Negra gada gada. Magra gada gada. Thank you, Jesus. Makrekete krekete. Regrege de gede. Makrakata krekete kete. Manda brogada gada. Mente brostile brogada gada. Megrege de gede. Makrakata prostele brogada. We thank you, Jesus. We give you the glory and we give you the praise. Manta brokata kata kata kata. Somebody continue to bless the name of the Lord. Continue to bless the name of the Lord. Master brokata kata kata. Magrege de gede gede. Magrege de gede gede. Magrega da da da. Megrege de gede gede. Makra kata proste kreke teke teke. Magra gada gada gada. Libro gada 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 gada. Somebody bless the name of the Lord tonight. Continue to bless his name. Give him the glory tonight. Somebody master bro gada gada. Libro gada gada gada. Manta proste le prokata. Reproste le prokata kata kata. Thank you Jesus Christ. Master pro kata kata kata. Megre gede gede gede. Magra gada gada gada. Magre gede gede gede. Magra gada gada gada. Regre gede gede gede. Ma prasta la bro gade gede gede. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Ma prasta la pro kete kete kete. Ma prasta la pro kete kete kete. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. Mande gre gede gede gede. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen and amen. Praise the Lord. God bless you. God bless you um, all for joining us tonight on the hour of groaning. Praise the Lord. I'm sure some of you will be wondering why we don't sometimes show our face at 10 o'clock sharp. The reason is because we allow you 10 minutes to um, worship and uh, and praise God and prepare yourself uh, um, uh, 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 for the program. 
Amen. Worship paves the way um, uh, for the presence of God to take absolute control. And so that's why for about 10 minutes or so, we allow you to stay on so that you can praise God, worship Him before we um, commence, before we show our faces sometimes. And so God bless you all, those who joined, be worshiping with us from 10 o'clock, some of you before 10. Um, may the Lord continue to bless you and may the Lord continue um, to fight your battles for you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen and amen. So on behalf of our Bishop Francis Sapo, the First Lady, um, uh, um, Reverend Elizabeth Sapo, and our current President, um, Prophet Albert A.J. Chumo, once again, I welcome you all to um, tonight, uh, to a night, rather, of breakthroughs. Amen. May you break through in every um, area of your life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So God bless you once again um, for um, uh, 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 um, joining us tonight. And please do me a favor by liking it. If you haven't done so yet, please uh, um, continue to like it, like it, click the thumbs up uh, and then share it um, and send the link to... Um, as 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 many um people um as 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 possible and please send the link to as many um people as possible send the link to all your loved ones send the link to your friends uh, even your enemies sometimes the reason why they are giving you such a hard time is because they are demonic uh, uh demonically possessed uh, so if they come on and they are, they, are, they, are, they are liberated, you will also have peace. I mean, so get them to join. You never know. Um, because very often uh, your enemies are very inquisitive. They like to know what you're doing. Um, so <laughs> just send them the link as well. Uh, and, and I believe that they join it. The power of God will touch them. Uh, 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 and a revival will come in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, amen, amen. So God bless you for joining us tonight. God bless you. And um, we've been looking at... Uh, um, um, evil, um, evil cycles or evil patterns, amen. Um, and, and we've been doing some prayers against it. Um, for 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 the for the sake rather, for uh, the sake of those who um, have just joined us tonight for the first time, we we'll read um, some some scriptures. Uh, and then and then and then uh we will uh um go into a time of prayer again uh, some of the scriptures we've looked at um i'll start with joshua and the book of joshua chapter number 24 uh, joshua chapter 24 and the verse uh, um number two so we are dealing with evil cycles any evil pattern any evil pattern there's something that seems to repeat itself sometimes in the family negative something negative that seems to repeat itself continually either in the family or your personal life this is something you have identified in the family um uh, and i've discovered that unless somebody uh, uh, rises up uh, and confronts it it continues in the family amen and may you be that person who stands in the gap for the family and destroy that yoke of evil cycle um, in the family, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Uh, amen and amen and amen. And I'll say that one of the cycles I've identified, let's read Joshua 24 verse 2. I'm reading from the ESV version, ESV version, English Standard Version. It says, And Joshua said to all the people, that says the Lord, the God of Israel. Long ago, your fathers lived beyond the Euphrates, Terah, the father of Abraham and, and of Nahor, and they served other gods. They served other gods. 
they served other gods. And, and, and I was saying that the reason why the children of Israel um, loved seven other gods and couldn't stop uh, was because it started from their great great grandfathers. It started from their great great grandfathers. Amen. And so we see that even after God had delivered them um, from Egypt, despite all the miracles they saw, they worshipped a golden calf in the wilderness. Amen. And you realize that this, uh, as a result of that, they kept going into apostasy. They kept going into apostasy. Uh, one king will come uh, 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 and turn the temple into uh, a high place where they worship other gods. Then another one will come and the Lord will tell you how to clean it up. The moment they go, sometimes the moment they go and then, then another one comes on. Uh, in fact, it was so bad that even Solomon, such a great man of God, by the time Solomon was dying, it appears that he was worshipping other gods. He had married foreign women who led him astray. I, I believe, this, this is my personal belief. So, so we saw the cycle. Sometimes these things might skip, might skip one or two generations and then we to continue. And so they struggle. And as long as that idolatry goes, some of you, you where you come from, they are still worshipping other gods. They haven't stopped. In fact, that, that should be your prayer point until you see a change in your hometown. Until you see a, a change in the family. Some of you will be surprised to discover that only about 90% of your family members are still worshipping other gods. And you see, and those things uh, uh, bring curses along with it. And until somebody rises up and begins to stand in it for the family, it continues. God is a jealous God. God is a jealous God. Praise the Lord. Amen. And he doesn't want us to worship other gods. This is why sometimes you see even believers, those who claim to be, be believers. I'm a pastor for some time. I've been a pastor for some time now. And I've seen this. They're in the church. The moment they're into a little bit of trouble, you see them practicing um, strange things. Practicing strange things. Then they check, but they have other things in their room. I, 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 I have been into a house to pray for somebody and I was shocked at what I saw. This was an elder in the church. And sometimes that could be the reason that that spirit of idolatry runs to their family. And very often too, that is the cause of other evil patterns in the family. Because the devil will never give you anything for free. The devil will never give you anything for free. He's a hard businessman. He's an evil businessman. He will appear to be giving you something, but he will take 10 away from you. So that was their problem. They couldn't stay away from idols. And to make matters worse, the land they were going into was, was previously possessed by idolaters. They fought physically uh, 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 to liberate the land and occupy the land, uh, amen. But they didn't do a spiritual cleansing of the land. They didn't do a spiritual cleansing of the land. And it's not something you do once and stop. Because I made you to understand, I want to say this again, that, that you can destroy the monuments of an altar but the spirits were, that were invited when that monument was built, when that altar was raised, uh, continued to float around.
They come because spirits don't die. And so if you come from a family background of very strong idolatry, you need to pray. You need to pray. You need to pray. And the Lord will set you free tonight. Please, please, somebody needs to hear what I'm talking about. And if you are watching me, make sure you are focusing. You're not busy doing other things in the house and watching me. Because sometimes when you do that, you can't also fully benefit. Amen. You come and type amen and then go away and do something. Ten minutes, come back, type amen and go away. Um, um, sometimes it's not the best. Make sure that um, you are fully um, um, participating. Amen. Then we looked at Matthew chapter. Um, we are not going to read this one for the sake of time. Matthew chapter 22 verse 25 to 29. Matthew chapter uh, 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 chapter 22 verse 25 to 29. Amen. Here were seven brothers uh, married to one woman in the Bible and they all died. Seven brothers all died. I can't seven brothers die. Got married and died, got married and died seven times. I mean, read it in your whole time. We don't have time to, to go through that. But really, we've read it before. So if you are just joining us for the for the first time, I mean, make sure you you you, you read it. I mean, and seven brothers died, one after the other. One after the other. They kept marrying the woman. The moment they died, then the woman also died. Almost as if she was the agent that the enemy was using um, to cause the death of the men in the family. I think I think we are going to start with that tonight. I think we are going to start with that tonight. That the agent behind that evil cycle must go. Amen. And last night we prayed against limitation. We'll continue with limitation at some point. Amen. But tonight, uh, that, that, as the Lord has let, laid upon my heart, we are going to pray against any agent, satanic agent, behind that evil cycle. Just a moment. Just a moment. But yes, we are going to start with that tonight. Any evil agent. Yeah. Solomon's one was the woman he was married. It was the woman he was married. They turned their heart away from him. So they turned his heart away from God. Praise the Lord. And so we are going to um, pray against any evil cycle. Um, um, uh, in your personal life or in the family. So I, I spoke to a lady some time ago um, from a, a particular country in Africa. And I think I've mentioned this here before. Uh, every year, there's a particular date that somebody dies in the family. They will either die just before that date or on that date. They never die after that date. They will die just before that date, or on that very day, they'll die. These are not normal things. It's a mystery. And tonight we are going to pray against any power behind that mystery to expire and lose its hold from your life and the family. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise the Lord. But let's pray, pray this prayer first. Say in the name of Jesus Christ. Tonight, I destroy any yoke of evil cycle in my life or in my family. I destroy you by the anointing 
in the name of Jesus Christ. Let's take this prayer again three times. Say in the name of Jesus Christ, tonight I destroy any yoke of evil cycle in my personal life or in the family. I destroy you by the power of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus Christ. For the third time, say in the name of Jesus Christ, tonight I destroy any yoke of evil cycle in my personal life or in the bloodline. I destroy you by the anointing in the name of Jesus Christ. Now lift up your voices and begin to pray. Lift up your voices and pray. Lift up your voices and pray. As we are praying, call somebody. As we are praying, call somebody. As you are praying, call a friend. As you are praying, uh, uh, share the link. As you are praying tonight, somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Intensify your prayer tonight. Mata Somebody can't you to pray. Somebody can't you to pray. Somebody can't you to pray. Somebody pray. Pray, pray. You are doing very well tonight. Continue to pray. Intensify your prayer. Intensify your prayer. Continue to pray. Continue to pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Mantala Mantala Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. You are doing very well. Continue to pray. Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. Men to Manta prostele Intensify your prayer tonight. Intensify your prayer tonight. Somebody pray, somebody pray. Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. Somebody pray tonight, somebody pray tonight. Continue to pray. Destroy any yoke of evil cycle in the family by the anointing. In the name of Jesus Christ, somebody pray, somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. Somebody pray, somebody pray. Manda broga da 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 da. Le broga da makra kata proke teke teke teke. Intensify your prayer. Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. Oh, somebody pray, somebody pray. Continue to pray. Somebody continue to pray. Megre ge de ge de ge de ge. Somebody pray, somebody pray. Manta proka ta kata kata. Destroy, 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 destroy. Mande broga da 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 da. Megre ge de ge de ge de. Somebody pray. You are doing very well tonight. Continue to pray. Destroy that yoke of evil cycle. Destroy that yoke of evil cycle by the anointing. By the anointing. Destroy, 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 destroy. Mande broga da 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 da. Regre ge de ge de ge de. Regre ge de ge ge de ge. Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. Somebody pray tonight, somebody pray tonight. Somebody can't you to pray. Somebody can't you to pray tonight. For the next two minutes, can't you to pray. Ma Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. Manta prostele prokata. 
Mikrasta la prostele broga dagada. Intensify your prayer tonight. Intensify your prayer tonight. Intensify your prayer tonight. Oi, makra kata 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 kata. Regrege dege dege dege. Somebody pray. Randa broga dagada. Somebody pray for the next two minutes. Destroy the yoke of evil cycle. Destroy it tonight. Pray like never before. Pray like never before. Pray like never before. Continue to pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. Intensify your prayer and get everybody on board. Get everybody on board. Get all your loved ones on board. Get all your loved ones on board tonight. Father, we thank you tonight and we give you the praise. We give you all the glory in the name of God, the Father, and the Son, and Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen and amen. Our next prayer point, we are dealing with the agents behind that evil cycle. Sometimes there's somebody, that person, the family responsible. There's somebody, sometimes, there's somebody that the enemy is using to, 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 to ensure that that evil cycle is repeated. I, I, I've been in cases like that where um, um, somebody was telling me that there was a particular member of the family who um, would, would try to befriend you after you have married uh, and, 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 and once they do that, then they'll find a way of making sure that your marriage goes down. I've dealt with cases like that. Amen. Do they find a way? I advise you wrongly. In fact, I've even seen that in my church before. Where there were some issues going on in the church. And I was talking to the various groups that were going through problems in the church. But each time they all spoke, there's a particular name that came up. There's a particular name that came up. And it looks like that person was going around and winding them all up. That person was behind it. It's a similar thing sometimes in the family. That there's somebody. Somebody, an agent of the devil in the family. And sometimes if you can't discern uh, or if you don't pray for the Lord to, to drive them out of your life, uh, they, they can cause you to repeat that cycle. Uh, when we look at the story in, in the book of Matthew chapter 22, it was that woman. She marries you, then you die. Marry them, then, 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 then you die. Marry, and it went on to the seventh brother died. Then she died. We are going to pray against anyone behind that evil cycle in the family. That the Lord will deal with them tonight if they refuse to repent. That the Lord will expose them tonight if they refuse to repent. They will never have peace if they refuse to repent. That the Lord will eliminate them from the family if they refuse to repent. Amen. Now lift up your voice and begin to pray against any agent. Begin to pray now. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Any agent of the devil in the family responsible for that evil cycle. Somebody begin to pray. Somebody begin to pray. Intensify your prayer. Intensify your prayer. And this prayer will deliver somebody. Please get them on board tonight. Get them on board tonight. Get everyone on board tonight. Get everyone on board tonight. Somebody pray. The Lord laid this prayer topic on my heart. Amen. And so continue to pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. Somebody pray. Makrakata prokata kata Migra gada gada gada. Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. 
intensify your prayer. We are praying against that evil agent, sometimes in the family, responsible for that evil cycle. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Oh, intensify your prayer tonight. Intensify your prayer tonight. Mente pro kata 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 kata. Somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. Mente pro stele pro kata kata kata. Continue to pray. Somebody continue to pray. Manda bro gada gada gada. Somebody pray. You are doing very well. Continue to pray. Man Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. Intensify your prayer. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Now, now let me read that story to you again from 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 um um uh, 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 from the English Standard Version. Amen. Matthew chapter 25, uh, 22 verse twenty-five. I wasn't going to read it, but let me read it. I wasn't going to read it, but let me read it to you. Matthew chapter 22, verse 25. Now, listen to this. It says, there were seven brothers among us. So, there were seven brothers who lived among them. Amen. It says, the first brother married, but died. He had no children. Then the second brother also died. The same thing happened to the third brother and all the other brothers. And then, then the verse twenty-seven says. Then that verse twenty-seven says that the woman was the last to die. <laughs> the woman was the last. This is the ERV version. So the same thing happened to all the brothers. It's possible. It's possible that they all married and also didn't have children. Then after they had died, then she also died. She was the last to die. After she had killed seven brothers. And I was out. Now listen, listen to this carefully, please. Listen to this carefully. I, I've been a victim of this before. Watch this carefully. And I was saying the other day, I think it was a prayer of Jabez. But by the time he got to the third brother, the other brother should have known that something was wrong. But how come they couldn't stop? Okay, the, the third one didn't get it. The fourth one should have noticed that something was wrong. At least the fifth one should have noticed that when they married this woman, they died. The sixth one, what, what happened to him? The seventh one at least, if six brothers have died by marrying this woman, why would you also foolishly stand there to marry her? But I realized that, you know, this has happened to me before. Sometimes it's, 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 it's as if you are under a spell. I'll say it again. Sometimes it's as if you are under a spell. I'll say it for the third time. Sometimes it can be as if the men or women in the family are under a spell. So they see the danger, but they can't avoid it. It's almost as if a demonic spirit takes over your senses so that you can no longer reason. I'll say it again. This has happened to me before. And I remember my mother used to tell me, Stephen, you need to put your life in order. She kept saying it, but I couldn't hear her. I couldn't hear. She kept saying, she kept praying for me. But it, 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 it came in through one window, went out through the other. And sometimes it's as if they are under a spell. And they keep making the same mistake and repeating the same cycle. It's almost as if the spirit controls them. 
you would think that at some point the other brothers would have noticed that something is wrong. No. That is how that spirit of praise, when the evil cycle uh, goes on in the family. They go and marry a particular, they go and marry from a particular tribe, and when they go into that tribe, something bad happens to them, and yet they can't stop. They all invested in the same business and fail, and yet everybody keeps doing the same thing. Now, as I was just reading it now, that the Holy Spirit was drawing my attention to it. I've been through it before. Now, what am I saying? Very often when they are under that kind of spell, no matter what advice you give them, they can't stop. I know a particular family that if you're a man and you drink alcohol, you go mad. So all the men who are drinking alcohol are, are, are mad, are mad. They are crazy people. And yet, somehow, they can't stop. And very often, it's, it's, it's as if they are under some kind of a spell, a demonic spell, an evil spell that controls their senses. And so, when the Lord saved you, you have been advising them, but they can't hear you. They can't hear you. They can't hear you. And the Lord was telling us to stop and pray against that stronghold over the men and the women. I know families where the men like strange women. And, and when, when, when they take strange women, they, 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 they're normally very wealthy. But the moment they pick the strange woman, then they'll lose everything. And no matter how people advise them, they couldn't hear. They had become like zombies. They had become like zombies. The spirit from the altar was controlling them, and so they couldn't stop. Now, you might be born again, and you might be free from it. Tonight, you're not praying for yourself. This particular prayer... You are going to pray for that brother or sister that you have been advising uh, or, 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 or that son or that daughter that I, I used to be like that. My mother used to tell me. Several times when she came to live with me in London. But I couldn't hear her. I couldn't. Until and this is how I went to Calvary. Until one day, um, I, 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 there was this girl who was my friend. We were not having any anything sexual, um, but she was my friend. Um, uh, we were hoping that something would come out of it. And, and, and then she took me to Calvary Charismatic Baptist Church, where I worship now. And it was a prayer meeting. I had never been to any prayer meeting like it before in my life. Sometimes that's what that thing does. It keeps them away from where they can get their deliverance. It keeps them away. They'll go to some churches where they don't believe in these things. So that the, the evil cycle will continue. It keeps them away from where they can get their deliverance. But somehow I, I was just following that lady. And, and then, you know, I was kind of interested in her. And that's how I entered Calvary Charismatic Baptist Church that, that day. We didn't plan to go to church. We were just passing by. She said, that, was, that, that, that is my church. It was a Friday prayer meeting. And then I walked in there. And, and that is when my, my eyes opened. That is when my ears opened. And so sometimes when this, this evil cycle is going on, it's as if uh, there's a spell, there's a, there's, there's a spirit, there's a stronghold, uh, there's a power that controls them to do the, to do the wrong things uh, that will cause them to repeat the evil cycle. And tonight we are going to pray. Now tonight we are praying for somebody in the family who is still under that bondage. You are praying for that sister who is still under that bondage. That, that, that the Lord will deliver them tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. 
and that thing controlled me for many years until I entered Calvary Charismatic Baptist Church. That is why I don't joke with my church. That is why I, I keep saying that I can't walk away from my church. Now, how come seven brothers, you all married the same woman and died? And it's because sometimes there's a spell. There's a spell that controls the men. Or there's a spell that controls the woman. So, so you see that the women go for a particular kind of man, men. The women go for a particular kind of men um, whom they will marry and not succeed in their marriage. And they saw grandmother go through it. They saw, they saw um, mommy go through it. Uh, they, they saw their cousins go through it. Uh, they saw their uh, nephews going through it. And they also did the same thing. And sometimes the parents are trying to tell them that, can't you see that when we marry from this particular place, uh, when we marry this type of men, can't you see that our marriage is broke and they can't hear you? They cannot, unless the Lord intervenes. Unless the Lord intervenes. When it gets to that stage, advice is useless. Doesn't work. The only thing that works is the power of the Holy Ghost. And so tonight we are going to pray for the men and women in your family. Don't pray for yourself. Unless maybe you think you are under that kind of um, spell. You are going to pray for that brother, that sister, that everybody has been advising and they are not listening. Very often that's what it is. They become zombies. It controls them. The spirit controls them. And until that spell is broken, they will not hear, they will not see. But I believe tonight, as we raise our voices tonight, the Lord will set them free. Say in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we destroy any evil spell, any evil charms controlling any member of my family. Lord, I stand in the gap for them. I destroy that spell. I destroy that charm. Say in the name of Jesus Christ, any curse pronounced against the men or women in the family that is controlling them tonight. I revoke that curse in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I declare freedom over the men and women in my family. In the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, now lift up your voice and begin to pray. Lift up your voices uh, and begin to pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Uh, intensify your prayer. This prayer is serious. Very important prayer. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. I, I, I speak from experience. Uh, so somebody pray. Somebody pray. When they are under that spell, advice doesn't work. I'm telling you. When they are under that spell, if you invest in their life, you waste your money. You waste your money. Oh, it doesn't work. But when the spirit of poverty is operating, you invest in their life, you waste your money. Because that thing is still controlling them. They have become zombies. Be controlled by evil spirit. Break that spirit over their life. Break that spell over their life. Revoke that curse over their lives tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ. Mention their names uh, and pray that the Lord will set them free tonight. But don't type their names uh, and pray, 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 pray. Something is going to happen tonight. In the name of the, in fact, something is happening tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Pray with intensity. Pray with intensity. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Continue to pray. Oh, somebody pray. Pray, 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 pray. Mantala brogadagada. Somebody continue to pray. You are doing well. Pray, 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 pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray tonight. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Pray, pray, pray. Rakra kata kata. Destroy. We destroy. Mantala pro kata kata kata. Minta pro kata kata kata. 
any evil spell, any charm controlling the men and women, the family. We break it, we destroy it in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody pray any curse pronounced against the men and women, the family be revoked tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. For Christ has redeemed us from every curse of the law. Having become a curse for us, Christ has become a curse for us, and therefore we stand upon the word of God tonight and we revoke that curse, we destroy that spell, that charm in the name of Jesus Christ. Lose your hold from the men in my bloodline, lose your hold from the women in my bloodline in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray. Manta pro Somebody pray. If Pastor Abi is watching us, please type it down. Our next prayer of Jabez will deal with it. We will deal with evil spell, evil spell, evil spell, evil charms, charms, uh, and incantations and, and curses that control men and women in the family. Somebody pray, somebody pray. Pastor Eddie, if you are there, please, I know you are the one who constantly reminds me. Somebody pray, 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 make a note of it. Uh. Our next prayer of Jabez, not tomorrow. Tomorrow's prayer of Jabez has been cancelled because this week we want the focus to be on the women's program. So tomorrow's prayer of Jabez has been cancelled. Uh. So somebody pray, somebody pray, somebody pray intensify your prayer somebody intensify your prayer somebody intensify your prayer hey makra kata 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 manta pro kata 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 in jesus mighty name amen and amen and amen that is what we also call mind controlling spirits amen yes mind controlling spirit that is what we call mind controlling spirit it's a spirit that controls the mind the minds of the men praise the lord so th daddy had a lot of wives a lot of things happened to daddy because of that you saw what happened to daddy and you are trying to control yourself but you can't and you find yourself doing the same thing you, 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 your son saw how grandfather suffered. You, you, your son saw how you are suffering. And, and your son can see that it's bad, but he's also doing the same thing. Amen. For the next few minutes. Now, you are, you are not necessarily praying for yourself unless you feel that you are still a victim. Amen. But you are going to pray that any mind controlling spirits working against the men in the family will be destroyed. Bind it and expel it in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody pray. Lift up your voice. Pray right now. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Pray, 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 pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray, somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. Intensify your prayer. Makra kata 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 kata. Somebody intensify your prayer. Somebody intensify your prayer. Any mind controlling spirit, uh, controlling the men in the family, will destroy. Any mind controlling spirit, controlling the women in the family, destroy, destroy. Pray for that brother in the family. Pray for that nephew in the family. Pray for that niece in the family. Pray for that uncle in the family. Pray for that auntie in the family. Because very often uh, they are victims. They are victims. Uh, they are victims. They are victims of that spirit. They are victims. They are victims of the altar. Somebody pray that the Lord will set them free. That the Lord will set them free. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Hey. I put it, destroy, destroy, destroy. Are there an all a powerful prayer? Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Manta that the Lord will set them free, that the Lord will set them free, that the Lord will deliver them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh, somebody intensify your prayer. Somebody intensify your prayer. Somebody intensify your prayer. Somebody intensify your prayer. Very soon I'll be mentioning your names and I'll be praying for you. So get everybody on board. Get everybody on board. Get everybody on board tonight. Magra gada gada gada. 
Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Mantala Somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. 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 Hey, Makrakata kata. Continue to pray as I mention your names and pray for you. Once I mention your name, please, 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 uh, 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 um, don't type uh, again. Uh, but don't go away, amen. Uh, don't type again, but don't go away, so that I can mention as many um, names as possible. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Makrakata kata kata. Somebody pray. In the name of Jesus Christ. Mama Teresa Champo, I pray for you first. Because you tend to be one of the first people to join. Mama Teresa Champo, I pray for you. I pray for all your children. I pray for all your grandchildren. I pray for your great, great, great grandchildren. I pray for all your in-laws. Mama Teresa Champo, I declare total victory over your family. In the name of Jesus Christ. My criteria, I declare total victory over your family. Family. Mama Glory said here, I declare total victory over your family. Sephora and Zinga, I declare total victory over your family. Nanakweku, I declare total victory over your family. MD, MD, Mama Evelyn Boatima and Mama Yadufi, I declare total victory over your family. Yvette, I declare total victory over your family. Kwati Emmanuel, I declare total victory over your family. King, I declare total victory over your family. Omo and Angela, I declare total victory over your family. Nanefua, I declare total victory over your family. Dorina Jaya, I declare total victory over your family. Uh, Juliet Amwakwa and family, I declare total victory over the family. Mama Cecilia Hughes and Levi and the family, I declare total victory over your family. Alita Kavikotora, I declare total victory over the family. Esther Buache, I declare total victory over the family. Efwa Epicenter, I declare total victory over the family in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody pray, somebody pray. Somebody pray. Anthony Lafita, I declare total victory over the family. Tenny, I declare total victory over your life. Jola, I declare total victory over your, over your life. Tamara Mensa, I declare total victory over your life. Esther Ama, I declare total victory over your life. Mama Joyce Marcelino and family, I declare total victory over your family. Ade and Ola, I declare total victory over the families. Uh, uh, Mama Lydia Yafe, I declare total victory over the family. Mama Evelyn Karamaji, I declare total victory over the family. Harriet Asari, I declare total victory over the family. Mama Teresa Donko, I declare total victory over the family. Minister Marcos Keto, I declare total victory over your family. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Mama Comfort Men, I declare total victory over the family in the name of Jesus Christ. Pastor Gladys Smith and Apostle Smith. I declare total victory over the family. Adwa Atta. I declare total victory over the family. Mama Hotensia Maguiti. I declare total victory over the family. Sonia Morris. I declare total victory over the family. Rosemary Mensa and family. I declare total victory over the family. Somebody pray. Paul Asifu Ochre. I declare total victory over the family. Mama Florence Jima. I I declare total victory over the family. Silvet Mambu and family. I declare total victory over the family. Vicky Enim and family. I declare total victory over the family. Mama Seta Daniel. I declare total victory over the family. Veronica and J. Bediako and family. I declare total victory in the name of Jesus Christ. Now in cancer, I declare total victory over the family. Silvet Mambu and family. I declare total victory. Anastasia Nyako. I declare total victory over your family. Mama Florence Jima. I pray for you again. And I declare total victory. Eric Amwako, I declare total victory over your family. William Bonsu, I declare total victory over the family. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Intensify your prayer. Mary Anna, I declare total victory over your family. Now in cancer, I declare total victory over your family. Esther Boache, I declare total victory over your family. Margaret Gabrieli Mensa and family. Yes, thank you for supporting me. I declare total victory over your family. Una Bright and Eva Bright and the 
the family. I declare total victory in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Somebody intensify your prayer tonight. Magraga Dagada. Yunis Ama. I declare total victory over the family in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Claudia Tonto. I declare total victory over the family. Chica Soronadi and family. I declare total victory over the family in the name of Jesus Christ. Rita Bonsumensa. I declare total victory over the family. Sydney. I declare total victory over your family. Justina Peters. I declare total victory over your family. Somebody come to the pray. Harriet Asare. I declare total victory over your family. Somebody pray. Rita Awu I declare total victory over your family. Somebody intensify your prayer tonight. Continue to pray. Continue to pray. Continue to pray. Sarah Kakimbo and the family. I declare total victory. Ragra over your family. Bragada, gragada, gada. Hey, bragada. Yes, Gabriel Mensa. I like that. He said, every family member, open your eyes. It's important that you listen to what I'm saying. Ragra, gada, gada, Babe, I've been, I declare total victory over your family in the name of Genoveva do Rosario, I declare total victory over your family in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Sir. My pastor, Krakata Kata, somebody continue to pray. Somebody continue to pray. You are doing exceptionally well tonight. My Krakata Kata, Fatu Fatu, I declare total victory over your family. In the name of Jesus Christ, uh, now Momo, I declare total victory over your family. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, uh, Adua Aduma, I declare total victory over your family. In the name of Jesus Christ, uh, Pastor Stephen Ado, uh, Jesse Christian Davis, uh, and all the Joanna Campbell and all the others, uh, I declare total victory over your families. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, uh, and I declare victory. I declare victory. I declare victory. I I declare victory. I declare freedom, right? Freedom, 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 freedom. I declare freedom over your family. Freedom, freedom. I declare freedom, freedom. And may the Lord lose the men in the family from any mind controlling spirit. The Lord lose the woman in the family from any man mind controlling spirit. Aban Cirillo, I declare total victory over your family. Gloria Yanka and the family receive total victory in the name of Jesus Christ. And I declare freedom. I I declare freedom, freedom over the women, freedom over the men, in the name of Jesus Christ. Any member of your family who is under any spell and wherever they are around the world, may the Lord set them free tonight. May the Lord set them free tonight. May the Lord deliver them tonight. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen and amen. Praise the Lord. That is why, that is why Saul had to have such a strong encounter with Jesus Christ. Because they were known for killing their own prophets. They were known for killing those that the Lord had sent to bring them deliverance. That's what Jesus said. And so Saul needed a very strong encounter. He had gone too deep in it. The Lord had to blind him and cleanse his mind, cleanse him completely, and then uh, restore his sight. And tonight, anyone who is under any stronghold, any, any controlling spirit in the family, may they have a strong encounter with Jesus Christ tonight. A, a, a deeper encounter with the Lord Jesus Christ, so that they'll be set free for good. In the name of Jesus Christ, Richard Amenyampo and family, I declare victory over your family. And for a person and the entire family, receive freedom tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you and we give you the glory. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. Teresa St. Louis and the family, I declare total victory over your family. PK, I declare victory over your family. Any mind controlling spirit, I break it over the family. In the name of Jesus Christ, Rapro Hereta and family, I declare victory tonight. I break and destroy any attack against your family. Erika and Ketia, I pray for you also. I declare victory over your family. In the name of Jesus Christ, Eva Bright, I pray for you again. I declare victory over your family. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. 
Father, we thank you for tonight. We give you glory for setting your people free tonight. My God, as they go to bed tonight, let them have strong encounters with our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And let revival come to this family, sir. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Joel Kazadi and family. I declare victory over your family. In Jesus mighty name i have prayed amen and amen and amen now close your eyes and lift up your hands if i have mentioned your name don't type again the power of god is touching some of you right now the power of god is setting somebody free right now just close your eyes just for a minute or so and lift up your two hands if your eyes are closed uh, and you, your hands are lifted, you can't type uh, unless I haven't mentioned your name yet. Uh, Pastor Jane Campbell and family receive victory tonight. Abby Williams and family receive victory tonight uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, but if I've mentioned your name, please follow my instructions. Uh, just close your eyes. Close your eyes. I, I believe that is why uh, the Lord had to uh, close the eyes of Paul. Braga, daga, 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 daga. And then restore him. Raga, raga. Just close your eyes and focus on the Lord tonight. If, if I've mentioned your name, don't type. Sometimes you need to just focus. You need to hear what the Holy Ghost is saying. Amen. Sometimes you need to hear what the Holy Ghost is saying. Sometimes you need to hear uh, the directions that the Holy Ghost is giving you. So just close your eyes, focus up, and just lift up your hands. Now, F1 and family, I just Destroy any attack against the family. Receive victory tonight. Mama Hortensia, Maguiti, and the family. Receive victory tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Now lift up your hands right now. The Lord is touching some of you right now. Some of you are manifesting right now where you are. I bind and expel any mind controlling spirit, any spell, any charm controlling the men and the women in the family. I come against you in the name of Jesus Christ. By the prophetic unction of my life. And I expel you tonight in the name of the Lose your hold from that man's life. Lose your hold from that woman's life. With immediate effect in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, right now, receive your freedom tonight. Receive victory tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. I bind that spirit and I expel it tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. And I curse the root of it in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive your deliverance tonight. Receive your victory tonight. Receive freedom tonight. Father, we thank you for divine intervention. In Jesus' mighty name, and we have prayed, amen, and amen, and amen. God bless you. We've come to the end of the program. If, if you are manifesting, you can just uh, 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 let me know what was happening to you uh, very, as we bring the meeting to a closer, uh, and then I'll mention your name and pray for you. If something was happening to you while we were praying, amen, and that happened to quite a few of you, uh, don't be ashamed to type it. Don't be ashamed to type it. Uh, and just... Um, uh, 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 let me know what happened to you quickly and only tap it once uh, amen and i'll mention your name and then pray for you quickly as we close please don't forget um prayer of jabez tomorrow has been cancelled we do that anytime you have a major program coming up so that the focus will be on that program amen so this thursday to sunday we have our mother's um mother's um uh, convention uh, amen uh, a women's convention, rather, sorry, women's convention, women's convention, I was distracted, sorry, we have our women's convention, which starts on Thursday, and then um, Thursday, I think it's at six o'clock in the evening, get there early anyway, get there early, no, 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 get there early, um, yes, Ade and Ola, receive freedom tonight in the name of Jesus Christ, the Lord is touching you for somebody in the family, there's, there's a man in the family that needs deliverance, Ade and Ola, Amen. That's the person that the Lord is touching tonight. And I pray that wherever they are, may, may, may the Lord arrest them, wherever they are. Wherever they are. This is an adult. It's not a child. It's an adult. It's an adult. A grown up man. Amen. Wherever they are now, may the Lord arrest them and restore them tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. MD, receive your freedom tonight. I will pick any attack against you. 
in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive deliverance tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Uh, amen. He says he's yawning. Yes, receive your victory tonight. Whatever has happened to you, type it now. Don't be ashamed to type it. Don't be ashamed to type it. So don't forget from this Wednesday, Thursday rather, Thursday, Friday, um, uh, in the evening, and, and but, uh, Friday again is going to be a bishop there. The man who was preaching when I walked into that auditorium and the Lord saved me. He's going to be there this Friday. Please don't, don't, don't be too familiar. Amen. I've been preaching a topic called the weapons of the oppressor. And one of the weapons is familiarity. Familiarity. Don't be too familiar. Don't stay home. This Friday, Bishop is there. Be there. But the program starts from Thursday. We are going, the men and women, we are all going to be there. The men are going to be there to support the women. Amen. So let's be there this way, Thursday evening, Friday evening, Saturday evening, free dinner. Free dinner. Uh, if, if the men are allowed to be there on Thursday and if the men are allowed to be there on, on Friday, then I'm appealing to the president of the women to allow the men to also come and enjoy the food. Amen. If not, it won't be fair at all. <laughs> Amen. And then Sunday we go to our various branches. As a result of that, prayer of Jabez for tomorrow has been cancelled. Amen. So we can focus um, on that. Amen. So please make sure you are all there from Thursday and the Lord will bless you immensely in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. God bless you. I believe you have been blessed tonight. This is a very serious topic. I didn't plan this. I didn't plan this. Amen. As, as I read that Bible, those, the Lord told me to read those Bible verses. As I read it again, then the Lord told me that no, they were being controlled by something. They were being controlled by something. And I believe tonight, deliverance has come. I will continue with this definitely. But next week, Tuesday, we will deal with it especially. Whatever it takes to be there, please do it. It will save you from a lot of hassle. So please make sure you are there. Make sure you are there. Amen. Uh, so God bless you. Tonight at 2 a.m., we'll be praying from... Uh, um to tonight 2 a.m to 4 a.m um on zoom um it's on zoom not on youtube it's on zoom uh, one of these days maybe i'll do it on youtube one of these days um, but it's on it's on zoom and my number will come on the screen um if you want uh, further details um you can uh, um, um um send me a message and i'll send you the link or if you check my whatsapp status on my Facebook page, Stephen Mensa, Stephen Mensa on Facebook. Um, um, you see that you find the details there. If you scroll down a little bit, you will find the details there. And and then you can join me tonight at two. Mama Teresa Donko, I declare victory over the family in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. So God bless you for joining us. Please let's share the grace as we close. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives and we shall dwell in the house of the lord forever and ever amen and amen and amen may the lord bless and keep you the lord protect you the lord fight your battles for you in the name of jesus christ the lord bring deliverance to your home and your bloodline in the name of jesus christ may you conquer may destinies be fulfilled in the family in the mighty name of jesus christ the lord bless and keep you all the days of your lives in jesus mighty name i've prayed amen and amen and amen god bless you i love you all and i'll see you again tomorrow evening at the same time but a prayer of jabez in the morning has been cancelled prayer of Jabez has been cast. Please let everyone know. Amen. God bless you. Angela will do your year. Receive victory tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. I love you all. Bye. And if you don't mind, spend five minutes to pray for me and my family and my ministry. And please let me know that you pray for me. Don't forget, pray for me, my family, and then my ministry. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. I love you all. And bye. Bye bye bye. I do to receive victory. And for a person, I pray for you again. Receive victory in the name of Jesus Christ. God bless you, Esther Ama. God bless you. Receive victory in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. God bless you and have a great night. Bye 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 bye.
frost.